For today's farming requirements, it's very important to have a fine chop, even spread of the full header width of the combine for minimum till cultivations. Massey Ferguson Delta Combine uses 108 serrated blades mounted onto eight rows at high speed. The blades are situated further away from the centre to create the flywheel effect to reduce the power requirement and fuel consumption. The high input speed of 2500 rpm with the blades being further away from the centre will give us a very high peripheral speed. The speed on the outside will be very high, chopping the straw even finer and spreading the straw even further away at high speed. To engage and disengage the chopper is very easy from this position. To gain access to the chopper to service, the maxi spreader can be raised into the upright position to give excellent access. As you can see, we have excellent access into the high speed chopper. We not only have these serrated blades, but we also have stationary blades situated further forward. As you insert these further inwards, you generate a fine chop. Below the station blades, we've got a chop bar situated on my hand. That will help to deflect the straw quality to give us a very fine quality chop. When spreading the chop straw for wide distances, the Massey Ferguson Delta Combine uses a maxi spreader. Using an independent hydraulic system to control two motors controlling the impellers from the cab, the operator is able to control the speed of spread according to those conditions at the time. In the centre position, we have a splitter. This is able to spread out the material evenly at the centre position. When we have side winds from the left hand side or the right, the operator is able to control the impact of the wind and compensate the speed of the impellers to ensure the crop is spread nice and evenly 